When patients present to us for the question of epilepsy surgery, they typically have tried and failed two or three uh, different medications. Sometimes they're on a combination of medications. Uh, seizure medications sometimes, unfortunately, have side effects associated with them. Fatigue, memory impairment, uh, other problems such as that. Uh, depression in some cases can occur from medication use. Uh, so one hope for patients pursuing the possibility of surgery is that uh, we will be able to alleviate uh, the doses or and number of medications that they're taking if it's successful. Um, that's a very realistic possibility for patients who are appropriate candidates for surgery. That is a possible goal that can be achieved by surgery. Uh, short of surgery, there aren't many other options that will give rise to that. Um, patients who have seizures that are not controlled by medication, it's not often realized, but are at increased risk of sudden death and premature death. Uh, the phenomena called SUDEP, sudden unexplained death in epilepsy, is more common in patients who have uncontrolled seizures, especially grand mal type seizures. Um, patients with severe seizures uncontrolled with medication are at possible risk of premature sudden death. Um, if surgery is successful, it has been shown to reduce the risk of sudden death. Um, so we go over the risks of not doing surgery with the patient in addition to the potential benefits um, and uh, try to help them make, make a decision.